Hey guys, today I am making a um, smoky barbecue pork tenderloin sandwiches and they're the mini sandwiches. What I did was I purchased a regular pork tenderloin that had the, um, you get the two in one, you can purchase it and it's got two in a sleeve. This is not very big, um, so if you have a larger family you may want to purchase more. Usually it takes about two for our family. So. This is something that's made in the deep covered baker and it's really simple. So I've already cut up some onions that we've put down in the, in the bottom of the baker and I've taken the smoky barbecue rub, which is a pretty popular rub that Pamper Chef sells, and I've just sprinkled it all over the onions. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some olive oil and put it over top of, sprinkle some on top of this um, pork loin. What I'll do is go ahead and open this because I'm fixing to get my hands dirty. Just kind of rub it on. And this is one of my kids' favorites. Uh, they really enjoyed this meal. This was actually per their request. I'm going to drizzle the, um, or sprinkle some of the seasoning over top. Both sides. And this stuff smells so good. One of the other rubs that you can use is the smoky applewood rub and that would be a good alternative to the smoky barbecue rub for this. So we're going to take and put this directly on the onions. Onions come out so soft and yummy. And we're going to put the lid on and we're going to pop it in the microwave. And it takes only like 15 minutes to the microwave. Put the lid on it. Pop it in, 15 minutes. So while that's cooking, um, this is what we eat ours on. Um, this is just, I guess, the Aldi brand of the Hawaiian sweet rolls. So they're little mini barbecue sandwiches. So we'll cut it and then we'll slice these and they'll eat on the inside. Something else we like to do um, mayonnaise with ours. We like to put mayonnaise on it and sometimes, my kids love the mayonnaise on it. Um, and then you can eat it with baked beans or you can do a potato salad. We do chips with ours. It's just whatever side that works um, for this meal that you would like to eat with it. Um, and what I'll do is whenever this finishes in 15 minutes, what I'll do is I'll we'll give you guys a look at what it looks like on the inside. Hey guys, we're back and our pork tenderloin is done. I had to throw it in there for about an extra two minutes. It didn't quite finish in the thicker spot. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this out here. I don't know if you can see. The onions are yummy. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it. Turn this around so you guys can see it. Oops. Pretty tender. Very tender. And then the way that we stack it, or put it together, I've already got one of the rolls out. It's got some mayonnaise on it. And we're gonna take and put the, one of the pieces on here, right there in the middle. And then we put the onions on top. Look at those onions. Mmm. Yummy, yummy. This is probably mine and the kids' favorite part is the onion. And then we're gonna take and add tomatoes to it. So I've got some tomatoes already cut up. I'll just take a tomato. Roma really works best because these are such little sandwiches, but this is what I had, so. Oh, and there you go. So yummy, and I'll show you how much liquid was produced in the pot while it cooked, because I know you saw it earlier, it just had the onions in it with no liquid. Does it have liquid in there? So it made a good bit of liquid. Um, there again, super quick, um, especially for busy, busy moms. Um, I'm sure there's at least one day of the week that is you're so crazy busy, whether it's Wednesday before church, that you need to pull something together because you just got home from work and you need to get something on the table. So it doesn't take very long between cutting the onions up and putting, um, getting the pork tenderloin together and getting it in the pot and actually putting it in the in the microwave and everything it takes you know 20 minutes 25 minutes tops 
So super quick meal, and like my husband said earlier, it's, it's husband proof. They should be able to, to do this meal as well. So it's really, really simple. So try it, comment below, and let me know if you guys enjoyed it when you tried it yourself. Have a great weekend. Bye.